Welcome back to this Let's Play of Devil May Cry 4. Uh, today we get to do the first mission! Yay! Uh, it's not a terribly exciting mission, it's really just more like a tutorial of how to play. Like, see, move. How hard is that to work out? It also teaches you how to shoot a gun! Great thing to teach any children playing. You just press the button. But yeah, it's not not the most exciting part. It's, th it's the next missions where things start to uh, really pick up. This is this is just this is gaming for dummies, really. Jump! I didn't know you could do that. Oh, also that's a red orb. That's basically the currency in this game. It comes from just about everything, from furniture, from killing enemies, and there's also these uh, red orb crystals you come across sometimes, which you can beat the shit out of for more red orbs. And that's uh, that's how you jump. Now we get to learn how to side roll. Just a way of dodging. Basically, you to do it, you just... Uh, you, well, you don't do that. You just roll, basically. It's just a form of dodging. You do learn a, uh, a move later on, which shows you... which allows you to do a better dodge. Where you basically just like a sidestep. But, uh... That's not for a while yet, at least. It's a bit harder to pull off as well, because you have to get the timing just perfect. I guess this doesn't quite cut it. What's the point of packing a sword like that if you aren't even going to use it? I like how Dante mocks me. What kind of sword is that? Oh, yeah, now we finally get to learn to use melee. Pretty much the, what, what, what's going to be used about 98% of the time throughout this game. It's what it's all about, really. You don't really start off with a huge amount of moves either. You really only get one combo with one slight bit change to it, and that's about it. You, actually, you do get to learn uh, two more, but uh, it's usually, usually you'll be doing stuff like that. You'll be knocking them into the air with uh, this move. There's a lot of focus of aerial combat with Nero, really, because that's apparently one of the things they wanted to really do well with this game. They wanted to make the aerial combat really feel like you're in the, in the air when you're using it. Somehow they can do... Now we get to see uh, Nero's Devil Art, which is a completely new addition for this game. Never been used before in the Devil May Cry series, and it's a really good addition in my opinion. Basically it's just like a power arm. Capcom loves power arms, and this is their newest idea. Basically you can use it to pick up stuff and start beating shit over. So, you're looking to play, huh? Alright, I guess I got some time to kill. <laughs> Tough guy, huh? Well... Yeah. Take you down a couple notches. Whatever you say, kid. 
luckily it doesn't just end with p just picking up people. You can also uh, you can also drag people towards you. You can use it on bosses as well, which is one of the most satisfying things. But sometimes when you pick up enemies, it starts a little uh, action sequence. Like, well, I can do it. Come here. Um, oh, this is the problem with Dante when you fight him. He keeps dodging like that. It's really hard to get a good combo. There we go. You get something like this. You get, you, that, it works on all bosses, but usually you have to stun them or weaken them a bit before it'll actually work. There's actually a boss in the next mission which I can show you on how to do it, because that's easy to pull off. But yeah, this is just fighting Dante now. Because you can tell by the health bar at the bottom. That's Dante's. Mine's at the top left. And he's really annoying to kill, because he just keeps dodging. Come here! There we go. human, are you? We're the same. You and... I... And them. Huh? Though I suspect you carry something different from the others. What are you talking about? You will come to learn the meaning soon enough. But, business beckons. Hey! Adios, kid. And that just about wraps things up for this mission. Next time, we'll be doing mission two. First, let's see what rank I got. What did we get? SSB, which makes an A. Hey. Uh, also, we got some proud souls. I'll, s I'll explain what those are later. But I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Thanks for watching.